We're gonna check out this. There you go. Here you go. Now you're getting it. All right. Now we should get you some bedding in there and some food and water. And you'll be all set, huh, bud? Yeah. Good morning, buddy. Oh, you're going to get camera shy now. Good morning, everybody. How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, we hope you're having a wonderful day. Boy, do we have a surprise for this young man right here. <clears throat> we got a new product in. Uh, it's a Paw Hut Rabbit Hutch from Paw Hut. Um, they're going to be sponsoring today's video. They sent us a Rabbit Hutch. We're going to put it together and check it out and see if Cookie likes it. Um, I hope he does. I think he will. Uh, it's a little upgrade from this hutch to a little personalized hutch. So if you guys have rabbits and you're looking for a new hut, we might have just found the one for you. You ready, buddy? Let's get him some uh, food and hay and stuff. All right, got some fresh hay here for you, buddy. What do you want to put that? You want me to put that back here? Is that where you want that? Yeah, yeah. Boy, he sure does love some, some fresh hay. Ain't that right, buddy? Yeah. Well, you enjoy that, man, and we'll uh, go get your rabbit hutch put together. How's that sound? You get the easy job. Hmm? How's that sound? You get the easy job. All right. There you go. Enjoy that hay, bud. Yet again, just another very rainy, rainy day. Although it's beautiful. I love a rainy day. It's nice. But it just kind of sucks that you get trapped inside. Okay, so today we are going to be reviewing this rabbit hutch. It's from Paw Hut. It's an 83 inch two story. Uh, I got it all written down. I don't want to mess up the the, the, the tagline for it. Uh, but it's a Paw Hutch 83 inch two story deluxe extra large rabbit hutch. Uh, big bunny cage with a ladder and a run. It's $177.99 on their website and I will leave a link to the website in the description down below. Um, let's, let's open this bad boy up and see how easy it is to put together and uh, hopefully I can get I'm only putting it together in the house because it's so rainy outside. It'd be a nightmare doing it outside, obviously. So we're going to put it together here in the living room, see how it looks. And uh, maybe we'll even go get our, uh, our bunny uh, cookie and bring him in and see how he likes it. But this is going to be going outside, uh, inside our barn. So hopefully it's easy to take apart or I can fit it through the front door. Uh, but I thought I'd put it together for you guys and uh, just kind of show you exactly what we got here. open by the way this box is very light so the whole thing must not be too heavy so that's nice um, looks like a wall here oh cool and uh, yet again another a whole door that comes out so that's cool must be a separator wall I bet that separates separates something this must be the, the ladder. This is the ladder for him to climb up. It's a two piece, it looks like. We'll figure that out. This is the uh, the droppings uh, deal where you put, put it under there, his floor, and this is where all his droppings will go, and you can pull it out and uh, collect all the droppings. And yet again, another door. If I'm not mistaken, this is like the fourth or fifth door that this thing has, so that's really cool. No matter where your rabbit's at inside the hutch, you can get access to them, which is important if you want to get your rabbit out. Looks like we've got some hardware and some instructions. And I think that might be it for the box. So we're just gonna put all of our uh, trash back in there and get to putting this thing together. Okay, so we got some uh, hardware here. There's not a lot of it, so I'm guessing this thing gets put together pretty easily. Um, let's take, it, let's get it all together and put it together. Hey, here's the picture they have given us. It's got a one, two, three, four doors. 
um, and two roofs over the run and a nice uh, roof up here with a, uh, a cap piece. It looks like this is gonna be pretty simple to put together. I'm excited about this. All the hardware here is nicely labeled, easy for you to figure out what it is. I'm gonna use scissors to open it, make it that much easier. But I like how it's labeled so you don't get anything mixed up. Right, the instructions seem simple enough, uh, picture detailed, um, and there's only eight steps. So apparently this is very easily put together, which is exciting for me because well, I hate putting uh, complicated things together. <laughs> so within eight steps, we should be uh, have a new rabbit hutch. Very nice. All right, now we're gonna add this other side door piece and it's gonna fit right up to it. Make sure it's level and screw it in. that and you can do what I did I just put that tray in there to give me uh, something to rest this on while I screw it in well, as you can see the drawer still working really good Good. Got this little door here. Alright, it's time to put this roof on and they've put these wooden stops in here so it lines perfectly. So that's very nice. So you just put it on there just like that. And then the same with this one, it's got the little stoppers. So we're just gonna, there it is. So they have pre-drilled holes here on the back, um, but it was hard to tell from the front. So I just drilled a hole through there with the appropriate screw so I really know where it's at. All right, as you can see, this thing is coming together very nicely, very easily. There's a bit of a gap here, but that's okay because that's what this is for. We're gonna put that on top, screw that in. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm liking the way this thing is coming along. Functionality-wise, this thing is great. We've got opening doors. Let's finish putting it together and then we'll do a, a once-over. Well, as you can see, this is the Paw Hut um, Rabbit Hutch two-story deluxe, 83 inch two-story uh, Rabbit Hutch. And uh, I put it together not too long at all. It looks pretty great. It's got all this down here. Room-wise, you got access to all of your animals. Up here with the catching tray. that there same at the bottom get in there get that in there easily access your rabbits I think this is gonna be a great addition to the farm there we go now let's see if we can't carry this thing outside and make a place for it outside in the barn you ready for a new little hut a little play hut bud hey what's up 
You ready for me to clear out a spot for your new hutch? Huh? Let's see what we can't do, buddy. So I'm thinking the new hutch should go right over there against that wall maybe. Uh, and I'm thinking maybe have like two pallets on the ground with a piece of plywood underneath. I'm not sure yet. We'll just see how that looks. So as you can see, I got a lot of work to do. I got to move all this stuff. All right, we're gonna see if we can't get this bad boy out into the barn without it falling apart on us. I gotta say, that moved very easily. You ready to check out your new cage, buddy? You ready? Let's go see what it's got. Let's do it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Good boy. He's ready to go. Cookie's ready to go. All right, buddy. What do you think? Didn't figure everything out yet. I probably should have put him up up top first let him figure that out we're gonna check out this there you go what's up buddy can you use your steps there you go here you go now you're getting it all right now we're just gonna get you some bedding in there and some food and water. And you'll be all set, huh, bud? Yeah. So now down here, he's got all the room to go underneath. Boy, he's just listening to everything I say, ain't he? So yeah, now he can go underneath, hang out down there if he wants, come back up here, hang out upstairs, come over here and hang out if he wants. And I was thinking if I wanted to, if I really wanted to, I could separate these and it would just be uh, one rabbit could have the downstairs and this rabbit run, take that ladder off and uh, block that door. And this side, somebody could have the upstairs and this side over here. So you could almost have two rabbits in this one hutch if you wanted to is uh, what I'm thinking. So it might be good. That might be good for when we have two breeding females. We might let the two breeding females live in here, or maybe let Cookie live in here. I don't know yet. Well, as you guys could see, it was that easy to put the rabbit hutch together. I got that from Paw Hut. I'm leaving a link down below for you guys to find that for your own animals, your own rabbits, if you have any. Um, I'm, I got a small little farm here, and we're constantly developing it and getting new animals and stuff. So if you're into that kind of stuff, I encourage you to go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that way you won't miss any of our uh, fun adventures and family posts. Um, I think Cookie's going to be really happy. And now that he's got him a new setup, i got to get some hay in there, some food and some water and all that. Um, but I'm really excited about the new Paw Hut uh, Rabbit Hutch. And uh, I recommend it if you guys uh, need one. I'd say Paw Hut's the way to go. Thank you very much, Paul Hutt, for sending us one today. We appreciate it, and we hope we can work with you guys in uh, future projects. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, thank you for your time, and we'll catch you on the next video. And I'd also say I've heard from other people who've had similar uh, rabbit hutches like this. It's best if you can have them in a barn or something like this, and maybe not directly on the ground. 
um, and that'll help your paw hut last a lot longer. I've heard stories of people just having them outside and um, you know, if you have them outside and stuff, uh, the chances that the rabbit, and the, the paw hut itself, the material and stuff will start to go bad and stuff. But if you have it indoors like this, I think you'll be just fine. I think this rabbit hutch will last us a nice long time, especially for wear and what we're using it for. So I think it was, uh, I think it's a great addition to the farm.